I spent much of yesterday scouring the web to find what I personally feel are the top six websites of 2023 so far, and I thought I'd share them all with you along with my thoughts. So as always, make sure to subscribe, watch the whole video, and with that said, let's get started. If you enjoyed this video, check out designcourse.com where you can learn UI, UX, CSS, and more with my custom interactive platform that makes learning fun and easy. All right, here is the first one. Now this one right here is a portfolio for somebody by the name of Jonas Emmer Emerson. And I wanna show you if you, if I refresh this, take a look at this typographic effect where it's just kind of like, it just takes random characters and kind of fades them in or blinks them in a way. Very cool, very subtle. Something that this person also applied uh, in different areas like up here in other areas throughout the site. So right here we have immediately um, their portfolio. And what's really cool is when you click on the one of these grids, it'll grow to consume the adjacent grid elements and then show you the associated information uh, with the site right here. And then if you hover over these elements, it's gonna show you the different previews uh, of this particular project. So very cool way to essentially show, a very unique way, I haven't seen something like this done before. Uh, your, pro your portfolio projects. We have an about me section down here. A lot of accolades, big businesses. Uh, trust me, people. When people see these large, you know, just multi-billion-dollar businesses that you've worked with or clients, I basically you can have a career forever. Very, very solid. I like this. It's a minimalistic approach. I like the fine details, such as these very subtle borders that you see. Um, very, very nice overall. Next up is this site, very minimal loader. So it loads very fast and it's for a photographer up here, which we could see uh, Mathis um, uh, Handing Camp Photography. So very interesting user interface right off the bat. It's nothing cookie cutter. Um, and there's some really cool things happening down here with this UI, it's very cool. You can see it says drag right here and I can drag this and it kind of like scales down. It almost looks like you're looking through a camera uh, the way they've designed this. Uh, so if we go to portraits, we're gonna click open. Look at how subtle and how smooth this animation is. And that's done with uh, Bezier curves um, when it comes to the animation timing. And we can use our mouse scroll wheel here to go through different examples of portraits. We could also left click and look how smooth this is and drag this. Very, 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 very nice. Click on personal, it'll slide in a new UI here or thumbnail previews. We have a menu up here, which is done very well. And again, the, these sequence animations, uh, these are done with Greensock Animation Platform. I can almost guarantee you without even looking at it, very solid design here. All right, next up is Wonder Jaunt or something. It's probably not how you pronounce it, but as you can see, we have a very cool sort of clipping effect occurring here with what is likely 3JS uh, model that's probably position fixed because if I start to scroll as it's telling me to do, look at this, look how smooth this is. Very, very, I just love this sort of thing. Uh, this is like a little slider, kind of goes through different details here. We have smooth scroll. And the position of this element right here, this 3D element is gonna be predicated upon your mouse scroll wheel, or if I left click and drag right here as well. I really like this part. Uh, when we hover over, there's a bunch of different micro interactions that occur. For instance, you hover over this, it's gonna change the background color overall. Um, if I zoom up here, you'll see how we have this arrow animating going from stroke to a solid orange fill. And we also have this these two elements being kind of nudged over sequentially as well. And again, Greensock animation platform is likely being used here. Look at this character, very nice. And look at that, very smooth. I would imagine this might be like an SVG text to path sort of animation based on scroll. Overall, very, very solid, awesome stuff. All right, next up, Infused of Bioenergy. I've actually featured this site before. 
and I forget where I featured this. Um, this is just such an awesome site. Again, this is using what is likely to be 3JS, and this is for like a soda sort of company. If I scroll down here, what's really cool, there's nothing janky about these animations. Everything is just buttery smooth. I've looked through a lot today, a lot of the 2023 submissions, and sometimes they're just so I uh, just janky. The animations are not smooth. Everything about this is very smooth. We have this 3D element here, which is a canvas, which is likely fixed in the, the viewport with CSS, position fixed. And then as we scroll down, we have a lot of other things that are occurring here that are outside of 3JS. And this is a very cool sort of reveal effect based on hover. And just all the colors are very bright, very vibrant. The aesthetic of the illustrations is very consistent in their application throughout the design. Just very, very solid. This character is very cool as well. All right, next entry. This is just absolutely insane. We have a particle system here in 3JS and it's also responsive based on mouse position. We also, I uh, just have like a build your full uh, profile rather button way here. Look at this. Unreal, this is really, really cool. Now it's gonna ask me to enter my name. And then she disappears. I like the uh, micro interaction based sort of uh, sound effects. Oh, what's my email address? What's my email address? Of course. <laughs> I sense that you work at Simon.net, Gary Simon. Is that correct? Absolutely not. Anyhow, as you can see, very, very cool. All right, next up is Deso. Uh, Deso, I'm not really sure how to pronounce that, but this site, I'm telling you, is absolutely insanity. There's a lot to scroll through. I'm just gonna use my mouse scroll wheel and I'll show you <laughs> this crazy, crazy experience. So we have a, a kind of like a horizontal uh, scrolling marquee of Oh, Pantera, I love Pantera, of just logos. And then we can see this little 3D element. So we got 3JS in the background that is fixed. Now check this out. I'm just scrolling with my mouse scroll wheel, getting through. It has a nice speed. Sometimes the mouse scroll wheel is too fast or too slow and it just screws everything up. Now watch this. We're gonna keep going here. And now we're in like a 3D kind of like game world environment. It is absolutely nuts. It's not a game. All we could do is just kind of traverse through it with our mouse scroll wheel. Uh, but watch this. I love this part coming up. Watch. Oh, wait, that's not the part. <laughs> it's coming up soon. I just love the transition from 3D to flat 2D right there. Look at that. We come down and it reveals just a typical UI. Still have texture in the background. And then we're gonna come down to a new part. Look at that. Oh, just love this. Continuing on down. At this point, I think you get the uh, idea, but just take a look at the camera movement that's tied to scroll position. That's just gonna giving you random information. Obviously a ton of work. I love the, the RGB split that's occurring here as well. And there's also a texture being applied to it. Overall, very, very excellent. One of my favorite sites so far. All right, and that is gonna be it. This is, I, you know, a look at six different really just excellent websites. And obviously as we go forward uh, through 2023, I may do another video or two where we'll take a look at even new designs that have come out, interactive. And as always, make sure to subscribe just to catch those. Click that bell notification icon as well. And if you're interested in learning how to design really good UIs, definitely check out the UI UX design course at designcourse.com. Top link in the description, and I'll see you all soon.
Goodbye.